let's be real here for a second. You're just following the system. You're doing what you're told to do because that's all you know. You don't have to do that. Nobody has to do that. But nobody has the courage to step up. Now wait, hear me out. There's an example here. When you're a kid, kids do random things, right? Kids run around all day, kids scream, kids play. Kids have free will. Kids do what they want and kids main purpose of life is to have fun. Be that inner kid. Now, obviously, you're gonna have responsibilities to do. But deep down, everybody wants to have that part of their kid back and you can have it back. Take a kid, for example. If a kid stands on a table, everybody shouts, get that kid off the table right now. He's not allowed up there. But have you ever asked, why is he not allowed up there? Life has natural consequences for your actions. If that kid stays on the table, there's a chance he's gonna fall and get hurt, right? Right. That is the consequence for your action. But what you don't understand is that you don't let that kid have that consequence. You yell at him and he, he thinks that he did something wrong before he even knows he did something wrong. Now he doesn't want to make any more decisions. See, he's not confident of his decision-making abilities and he thinks no matter what he does, it's going to be wrong. This is what society has programmed us to believe. You can break out of this. You can try your new things. You can try whatever you want to try. Life will give you the natural consequence if it does not work out, but half the time it's going to. You're so scared to put yourself out there because you're scared of getting rejected and you're scared of how people are gonna think about you. But if you take everybody else out of the equation and put yourself first for once, what you don't want to do is probably the good thing to do for yourself. So go and do it. Have some fun and make your own decisions. Don't let other outside or extrinsic things dismotivate you to try to do what you would love and like to try to do. With that being said, there's a reason why people are just following the system. They feel as if they don't have enough balance or enough sustainability to be able to try new things. And once again, that's not true. For example, everybody thinks go to college, get a job, get married, sorry, get married, have a house, have kids, that's life. But that's not all life is. You need to find what life is to you. You need to find those values. You need to find those hobbies. You need to find the business ideas that you've been thinking of. You need to find what you want to do. <clears throat> life isn't what success is. Everybody says, I have such a good life because they have success. No, they have success because they have a good life. So to have a good life, you don't wanna have the best job or be married and have a big house. No, for a good life, you want to be happy. To be happy, you need to have things that make you happy that aren't just things. You want to have hobby you want to have free time you want to have that ability to play you want to have the ability to think and that's the biggest one because when you think you start realizing that there's better things out there and then that's when you get scared because you will never try those things because society programs you to not try them think 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 that is how you're gonna turn your life around okay for example, do you know how many stars are out there? No, you don't. Have you ever looked at a window for more than a minute without having to? You haven't. But maybe you have when you were a kid. Now this is how it all ties together, okay? We all need to be a kid and not the playful, stupid, unresponsible kid, but the kid who's free, to think, 
act, and play, okay? Having those decisions and that free will is gonna make you realize so many things that you never thought were true. It's just a shame that nobody does what they truly want to do. Nobody thinks what they truly want to think because they're too scared. But I'm telling you, don't fall into the system and not in a don't go to college, it's a scam kind of way. The system as if you just glide through life. You need to look around. You need to make sure life is what you want life to be. And you need to make sure you're around and surrounded by people that you want to be surrounded by. Don't just go to work, go to school, do the job. Ask yourself why you're doing this job. Do you want to do this to do this job? There's so many things in life that you can explore. There's so many things that you can think about. There's so many places you can go. But you trap yourself here in this life because it's the only thing you know. You need to get comfortable with the outside world. You need to get uncomfortable with the inside world. You need to start exploring and expanding your horizon. Because when you do this, it's gonna open up new opportunities for you. And it's gonna open up a new way of thinking. Being free is having the ability to do, say, think what you want whenever you want. That is why you need to act like a kid. Thank you all for watching this. My name is Zachary Rossmuller. I will post videos like this more often. If you want a specific topic, please comment down below and I will respond to you and I'll try to accommodate all of your guys' suggestions as well as I can. If you have any suggestions or any feedback, please comment down below. Uh, make sure to subscribe and I'll be posting videos like this more often from now on, but I will post shorts, funny skits and videos on my TikTok and my shorts. So if you wanna check that out, go ahead. My TikTok is in bio and my YouTube shorts is obviously in this channel down below. Thank you all so much. Have a great day and be that kid.